Welcome back to another video. It's the one and only Pocket Gaming. Today we're gonna find out who's the best PvPer in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. This video took me hours to make and edit, so if you could take a second to leave a like and subscribe, it would be greatly appreciated. Also, don't forget to leave a comment on your thoughts in the situation and click the little bell to have notifications for all my future live streams and videos. But without further ado, let's go. All right, let's cut straight to the chase. I've seen so many videos about YouTubers claiming they're the best at PvP, including myself. But I've actually been able to take the time out to really evaluate who's the best at PvP, regardless of server, region, and game mode. So I went around and I started asking people, who's the best player in each of the three communities for Minecraft Bedrock PvP? Now, if you don't know, the communities for those are UHC, The Hive, and No Debuff. I'm sure and I know that there's more communities out there, but right now, there's not enough information to really talk about those. However, we do know who the best UHC player is in the Bedrock community. This player's skill is almost unmatched and his snowball ability is literally insane as well as his strafing and aim. It's so hard to argue against this guy too when literally 80% of the UHC Bedrock community agrees that he's the best player. He goes by the name of Platt and he's been discovered through his YouTube videos where he posts his UHC highlights and a lot of his other combo tages. He's also been discovered in a lot of UHC rankings like this one for example where he was put in tier S uh, you know and pretty much every other uh, you know, generator I saw that someone made, he was literally also put in tier S, and these are made by custom players, you know, the best players in UHC. He joined the UHC community in 2019 for some background about him, you know, he played in a lot of these servers like Valiant, World, and Paradox, if you guys know what those are. And then Plaz, you know, he's just performed big time in almost every single UHC that he plays in. And, you know, he also showed up in the 1v1 tourney that we hosted, the pocket 1v1 tourney. He got first place. The craziest thing about Platt is he started watching UHC as MC Research in 2019, and he didn't have a PC, so he found a world from YouTube where he could play on his Xbox. So that's really how he got started. So if you guys ask me, I think this guy's got a bright future ahead of him. If you want to go check him out, you know, because to me... There's only so much you could believe off of my opinion, but I'm believing, you know, the opinion of the majority, you know, what I think the most popular opinion is based off of what I can also see PvP wise, you know, off of the skill. And when I watch this guy, it literally is like watching a Leo Messi, you know, a Cristiano Ronaldo, you know, like we're comparing a sport, you know, like those players in those sports. And I'm trying to compare, the, you know, him, a UHC player as one of the greats, you know, I think this guy has seriously got it. I think it's amazing how he's still here, you know, he's still out here trying to post content and keep this community going because, you know, I've seen the UHC community myself, you know, firsthand, and these guys have been, you know, never given up. They don't get the greatest support, you know, they don't have the most amount of players, but they don't give up, and I respect them a lot for that. Now let's talk about the Hive community. This is the most difficult one to really know. I'm sure we've all heard people say their favorite YouTubers like Dicey's, Quimston, or even the Crafted Manny, but I've been really looking out to try to find someone who, you know, someone who's really underrated. And I actually found someone. This extremely rare PvP talent is coming out of Asia. This player stands out to me the most because of their game sense, god bridging ability, and his CPS. These clips I have displayed on the screen right now are by Lord Day. Yeah, their name is Lord Day. I've never even heard of this person up until a few days ago, and I've been so obsessed watching all of their gameplays with how they can click at such a low CPS and still destroy players. He's a member of the popular Hive Clan known as Riot and has slowly been making a name for himself. So yeah, I wish him nothing but the best for the rest of his PvP career, and hopefully we can start hearing a lot more about Lord Day since he's made a recent return to the community and has even started posting videos in the last month on his YouTube channel. Now listen, I could be wrong with this, and it's okay. I want to really find out who's the best PvPer, guys. Like, trust me, it's so it's been so hard to really gather and look at every because you got to look at every single PvPer, and I've really tried. And to me, this is the best Hive player I think I've come across. Now, hear me out. For the honorable mentions for the Hive, I had to do something, and I had to put Tactus in this. There's a guy named Tactus, and he's literally one of the best Hive European PvPers. And also, I want to give the Crafted Manny a lot of props, too. For being a YouTuber, he's probably one of the best, if not the best, Hive YouTuber. Um, you know, that's kind of mainstream in a way, you know? So, yeah, let me know what you guys think about that down below. Now, the final category is no debuff, and I'm giving it to the one and only X Water. X Water has been the most popular PvPer in the no debuff community for so long. This man doesn't even use thumbnails and gets thousands of views a video, no matter how often he posts. And what's even crazier is he's best known for his PvP because of his strength and aiming ability, which has now led to his huge success. Most people discovered X Water through the word of mouth and his YouTube channel, which now has over 
500,000 channel views since he started posting in 2018. He's beaten the best players all around and he's beaten cheaters too. He usually plays on the server Versailles and is very versatile as he plays on the Hive too and has actually been ranked number one on Hive Skywars not too long ago. So yeah, go feel free and check him out down below in the description as well as everyone else. But before I end this discussion, I do want to give an honorable mention to the one and only Driacho, who is also another legend in the debuff community and UHC community. He's beaten literally two of the three people that I have in, you know, the top one for each of these communities, so I think he definitely deserves a place. But yeah, that's going to do it for today's video. I hope you guys all enjoyed. It's been your boy Pocket Gaming, man. I really love making these videos, even though I know they're super controversial and hard to make. But hey, it's been a great one. I hope you guys enjoy. Drop a like and subscribe if you do. And I'll catch you next time. It's been your boy, Pocket Gaming. Empire out.